Hi, my name is Joanna Cahill and I'm the owner of Healthy Home Cleaning based in Asheville, North Carolina. We specialize in green, non-toxic cleaning and today I'm going to teach you how to remove rust from the inside of your cooking pans. So today we're going to be using just any kind of scrubby brush that you might have around with nice stiff bristles on it. I've got a couple lemons here. If you wanted to, you could also use lemon juice, the kind that you get out of the grocery store in the little tube container baking soda, and a pumice stone, which you can buy at any hardware store. They're fairly cheap, usually about a dollar. And vinegar, which is also really cheap, and you might have it underneath your counter, or you can purchase it at your local supermarket. Okay, so maybe with the best intentions, you took that pan that you really didn't want to clean, and you said that you were going to soak it in the sink and you left it overnight and then that night turned into a couple days because the week got really busy and suddenly you've got a pan that has lots of rust that's flaking inside of it and now you really don't want to clean it but here's how you would. You're going to go ahead and take some baking soda and go ahead and sprinkle it on the inside of the pan. Add some of that lemon juice from our lemon And then just a little bit of vinegar. You don't need too much here. Just a little. And then go ahead and take your scrubber and put some muscle into it. Get into that rust right there. It shouldn't be that hard to come off. You scrub it in here. The abrasive power of the baking soda and the acidity of the vinegar and the lemon work that right out. But if you're still finding that it's too difficult, you can't get it off, you can go ahead and take your pumice stone. You're going to want to dampen the end of it with a little bit of water. And go ahead and work that onto it. Now I would say as a disclaimer that if you've got some really nice shiny pans like this one, that you really care about. You might not want to scrape them too hard with this pumice stone because it's going to leave little scratches on there. But if you're like me and you've got some tried and true that have been around for a long time, no one really sees them, and then you can go ahead and use this to get that rust off. And then after we're all done, rinse out all that debris from our pan. You might have to rinse out a couple times while you're cleaning depending on how dirty it is. And then we're done. This is Joanna Cahill with Healthy Home Cleaning and I want to thank you for watching how to remove rust from your pans.